Good morning. It is the 18th of November. Uh, I'm just, I haven't even started yet. I haven't even broken down the tent. Uh, but that's where I camped. Uh, it's, it's funny, when you camp at Lamplight, uh, you don't really see what's around you. I knew I wasn't far from Sandy Creeks, Sandy River. There's a branch of it right there. The, the main branch is sort of right where those trees are going on the cutting. But um, I, was, I was surprised when I got out of my tent this morning. I thought I was camped more in the trees. And uh, I'm definitely not in the trees here. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, I'm just gonna sort of show you this valley. And such a wonderful view, a corner there has to must still, you know, I don't know that that, well, yeah, I, I was going to say there has to be a corner of Mount Hood. So I'm pretty much due west of Mount Hood, of the peak right now. And uh, I have like an 800 foot climb or a thousand foot climb at one point uh, this morning. But it's uh, going to be uh, not steep climbs it's pretty much just you know like this always trending lower so last full day um, from where I am now it's probably uh, 42 miles something like that to uh, to the Columbia River at Cascade Locks anyway there's my tent I'll get packed up uh, be on my merry way. So I'm coming up on to Ramona Falls. This uh, used to be the main Pacific Crest Trail, according to a sign. Uh, rock slides, ooh, that is really beautiful. Rock slides up ahead, took out the trail in such a way that it's unsafe for stock. Hikers can apparently still make it through, but we should exercise caution. This is now listed as an alternate to the, uh, the PCT. That is beautiful. I'm glad I took this side trail. Adds a little bit of a little bit of mileage, a few hundred feet up that I wouldn't have had to take otherwise, but uh, wow, that, that really is nice. Ramona Falls. 